of preschool. Happy Monday. It's calendar time again. Let's get started. It's our new month, June. June is special because it's the last month of school. Let's start with our flag salute. Right hands on your hearts. One, two, three. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Make sure you're saying it. And to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Red, white, and blue, we love you. Wow, I can't believe it's June. It's the number one day. How do we say that? It's the first day in June. First, the first one. That's right. So friends, this is what we can count up to. Two special days. Wait a minute. I think there's three special days. I see something called flag day. Hmm, wonder if we can make something special like a flag. And I see the red, white, and blue on flag day. Cool, some stripes and stars. I also see a very special day. It's called an extra special day. Hmm, the afternoon class is graduating. I wonder if this is when we are going to try to get our diplomas. We're going to try to get our special certificates for finishing preschool. That is a special day. I'm hoping to do that that day. And then all the way over here, we have a 21. Wow, a 21. And I put that one there because summer starts. Yeah, we'll be out of school and starting summer. So we really, friends, have two more full weeks of school. This week and this week, and then we are gonna be finishing up over here. Okay, so we have really got something to be proud of. We really did a great job. Now, I wonder what day of the week it is. Let's go up here. We usually start our calendar on do you remember? Do I have to sing the song or can you try to remember that? Mm -hmm. Monday, you're right. I saw the M as a reminder. And I know that the first week, the first day of school is a Monday, right? And it is the first week of June. Cool, so today is Monday. The weather is sunny. We've had a nice weekend. Did you enjoy your weekend? Did you get outside a little bit? It was very nice for that. And I didn't even put up tomorrow. I want you to guess what it is. Monday. Hmm, not gonna sing it. Let's see if you can remember. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Did you say Tuesday? If you said Tuesday, you're right. Yes, tomorrow is Tuesday. Remember, there's no Zoom tomorrow because Miss Donna has some things to do in the classroom. So there's no Zoom tomorrow, but we'll meet again on Thursday. Okay? Okay. Now, let's take a look at our letter of the week. I wonder if you can guess what it is. It's the almost the last letter of the alphabet. It comes before Z before Z and after X. Hmm. Did you say Y? Y is our letter of the week. Little line, jump, and a big line. And look, lowercase y looks just like uppercase y. So that's an easy one to learn for lowercase too. Hmm, what's the sound for Y? Do you remember that from our foundations? Maybe you've been listening to the foundations on the computer. A, A, 
example a, and if you take it all the way to y, you'll see y, yellow, y, y, yellow, y. Hmm. I brought some yellow things for you today. We used to like to go on color walks together, right? And so I thought maybe I can go in my yellow bag and see what I find that's yellow. Maybe you can guess what some of these yellow things are. Hmm. What's this? I could take it and I could color something to make it stand out. It's a yellow highlighter. Cool. Let's see what else is in my yellow bag. Oh, this is funny. Yellow nail polish. Well, that's fancy. This is something that we eat. It's a yellow pineapple. This is a pineapple cup, but you can find yellow pineapple fruit. Mm-hmm. Oh wow, look in here. Yellow bubbles. I love playing with bubbles outside when it's sunny. And the sun is yellow too. Fun. Oh, this is one of my favorites. A yellow duck. Yes, I have a collection of a lot of little ducks. They're all different ones. This is my yellow duck. This is one of my large yellow ducks. He's fun too. This is kind of funny. I've been using a lot of Clorox wipes. I have. I've been cleaning up everything. And just like I used in the classroom, my yellow Clorox wipes. And last but not least, I have a yellow sweatshirt. That's a pretty color yellow, isn't it? You can find lots of yellow things in your house. If you go on a little yellow hunt, try that. See how many you can find. Okay, let's see what other Y words we have beside the color yellow. Hmm. Do you know what this is? You can hold it with a string. It can go down and it can go up. It says y, y like yellow. Do you know what that is? It's a toy. It's a yo-yo. Yes. Ooh, yes. And this is a little snack that you might have in the morning or with Miss Donna at school. Do you know what this is? It's usually made with fruit and milk. Did you say yogurt? Yogurt starts with why? Maybe today you can have a yogurt snack. Oh, and this one, I forgot about this one. I have a special story that I attached to your lesson today. This is a word. I'm gonna sound it out with you. Y, E, S. Now put those sounds together like a puzzle. Yes, yes. I sent you a story called Yes Day. Check it out. Maybe on Thursday, we can play a yes, no game on Zoom. I like to do that. that. That would be fun. We'll play like a little game on Thursday. Okay. Well, there's one more thing I wanted to talk to you about that we're going to be learning about this week. Do you recognize my friend? You do. Matt Man. I brought out Matt Man this week because we talked in the beginning of the year about the word me. Me. And when you drew a picture, sometimes we would write the word me. And in the beginning of the year, you drew a really nice picture of Matt Man looking like you. So I wanted to teach you a new word. Now that you know how to spell me, I was thinking, let's learn the word you. And it has a Y there at the front. Y, y, you. Do you hear that? Y, you. 
And this is how you spell it, only three letters. Y-O-U. So maybe this week we can do a Mat Man lesson and we can draw you. Maybe I'll send you some fun Mat Man things and you can do it too. Remember Mat Man? I think you do. We'll have lots of fun. Okay, boys and girls. So that was a great, great lesson. And now I just wanted to give you a little reminder for my afternoon preschool. Please remember to get those graduation caps and gowns on. Take a little picture. Try to remember your line. Do a little movie with you reciting your line. Maybe make a little dance for us, a little jump. And send that all to myself and Mr. Harvey, Mr. Will Harvey, and we'll make a wonderful graduation video for you, okay? All right, so maybe you can work on that on Tuesday since we won't be at Zoom. Maybe you can work on that since we won't be together. And my morning class will be meeting again on Thursday for a game, and Wednesday we'll be doing a lesson together. So I will see you soon, my friends. Bye, love you.